Apple today released a new 14.4 software update for the HomePod. And this update also introduces the new U1 ultra wideband functionality between HomePod mini and devices that have a U1 chip like iPhone 11 or iPhone 12 models. Please note that this U1 ultra wideband functionality will not work with the original HomePod, only the HomePod mini since it is equipped with the U1 band. So what does this mean exactly? Well, this update adds visual, audio, and haptic effects when the songs are transferred from a HomePod mini to a U1 enabled phone. When an iPhone is near or approaching a HomePod mini, the soft haptic rhythm will get stronger and faster until your iPhone is close enough to initiate the transfer between HomePod and iPhone. So as you can see here, as my phone gets closer, you'll start to see a little notification pop up, and that's when I'm feeling that haptic rhythm get stronger and faster. And then once I get right above the HomePod mini, the transfer will start and you'll see that pop up expand with media controls and the album artwork, and now the audio for my iPhone is currently playing on the HomePod mini. If I want to transfer it back, you just do the same thing. Sometimes you'll see a pop-up that asks you to actually tap to transfer back to your iPhone or even back to your HomePod sometimes, but for the most part, everything should just sort of transfer automatically. This functionality should also make things with handoff a little bit more reliable and a lot quicker, though I will say I've had my fair share of struggles while testing for this video. I think it's important to note that if you're trying this over and over again like I was in order to get the shot, things might get a little weird. It might help to step back a bit, away from the HomePod mini, and then come back and try again. I had my own issues, but it seems to be working just fine for other colleagues of mine who've tested this feature and had no issues whatsoever. The update also adds personalized listening suggestions on iPhone whenever your HomePod mini is close to your iPhone, and also it causes media controls to automatically appear without having to unlock the iPhone, again, when it's nearby the HomePod mini. Of course, I would love to know your thoughts on this improved handoff feature thanks to the U1 ultra wideband functionality improvements from the 14.4 update in those comments down below. This has been Dan with Mac Rumors. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you around in the next video.